So now after we made uh, two pieces exactly the same, now do not tie not at the same side. So when we put together uh, the pieces, knot will be on the same side. Now we will start from uh, the bottom. Put together both of these two pieces and then we will need um, the new line about one and a half feet or 18 month, uh, inches and put one white four millimeter in the middle paint black and red now I put red and in the last white on one side put a uh, black end on the other side please don't forget to make both pieces uh, same direction put together both in and pull so you get like this red and put one white four millimeter crisscross with black end and pull so you should see like this and now red end will put in the next bead on the top on right and black end put in the next bead on left so you should see like this now black end put one white four millimeter crisscross with red end and pull get like this Now black and put into next bead, which is red on right and uh, red and put into next bead on left. Red and put one red crisscross with black and and pull, so you get like this. Again, red and put into next bead on top on a right. And black end put into next bead on left. Get like this. So we will do the same until the top. Uh, black end put one white four millimeter crisscross with red end and pull. Pass black end into next bead on right. Pass red end into next bead on left. Red end put one Y four millimeter, crisscross with black end, and pull. Pass red end into next bead on right. Pass black and into next bead on left. Now it is red. Black and put one red four millimeter. Crisscross with red end and pull. So we will do the same until the top of the curve. And now I finished all. Uh, until the top right now. So right now we shoot four together and then pass black end into next bead on right, pass red end into next bead on left. Now we will do while you folding so it's make it easier. So we will do until finish the, all the curve. Red we should add red, white we should add white. So here is uh, come to the last part. I put uh, black end into uh, right and red end into left. And now we'll put last white and then tie knot. So right now we finish the outline.
and then we will do inside again need new line pass four millimeter in the middle and paint black and red put black and into left put red and into right the last uh, white both sides put together and pull so you should get like this now black and put one red four millimeter crisscross with red end and pull you should see like this pass black end into next bit on right pass red end into next bit on left red and put one white 4 mm crisscross with black end and pull so right now you will see red curve down to here like that and we will add one more white and then red so notice this side start with one white and then red and two white and then red We'll do the same until the uh, the the curve like this. So right now we do the same process until curve. We have one white here and red, two white and red and two white. And now we finished until here. So should see like this. The other side will have three white, one red, two white and one red, and two white and one red. Now pass each end into each side in three millimeter. And then add three millimeter crisscross and pull. So right now we will do all will be three millimeter until the end of the can. So right now I finish. It's all the same process, but all this will be seven pieces of uh, three millimeter. After we finish over here, we can uh, pass into uh, some bead and then tie in the middle of the cane. So right now, this is the size that perfect as the ornament. But for the keychain, all this here will be uh, three millimeter, and inside here will be seat bead. So we'll, uh, the size will be half size smaller. Thank you for watching, and see you next figurine.